sitting on the toilet. Sitting on the toilet. Sitting on the toilet. Sitting on the toilet. Okay guys, Techie TV here. We're back with another shopping ship. But we're gonna go to Old Time Pottery in a moment. But before we do that, I just spotted my local spirit store here that's coming back to steal this usual space for the past few years. Let's go. I know they're already stealing up a size. So let's go take a look what they got. Okay, so the only sign the window is that sign that says that the high link so you can go to a local spirit home that comes to the fire. This is actually my local spirit store. It's an Orange Heights, in the former Old Navy store. And you can see inside, not much going on. It's called to see with the glare. Let's see if it, there's like the wall here. They, uh, they got the baskets on the side. I can't see very much in there, but that's all you can That's the best thing you can get. Not much left in there. They got the shelves up, and they got all the, the plan papers on the shelves. There's no stuff. There's no one's in there. No one's inside, I see. Might be people in the back. I don't see it. Oh, here's a good view. Here's a good view of the inside of the store. Not really much in there yet. They got the shelves up and the walls up and stuff. The much, I don't see much going on, but we gotta go to an, a couple more spirits later on today. You can see this scene where that says the costumes and stuff. There's the sign right there. These are the doors that only the because they moved down to where his village around Prospect. Which that might be a possible spirit location where I can jump out of my transportation right from school home if they go that way and I can just go to that spirit if they're gonna be there or not. But there's Jack the Weaver. This is free for the Iran world. This is the inside. Double doors. Okay, you can see the walls here. Spirit. And okay, yeah, that walks up here, so let's move on to all time pottery, I guess. So let's switch things up a bit. We're gonna go to Old Town Party as the last stop, but we're gonna go to this Michaels here in Shamburg, the one on Shamburg Road, across from the home that we'll go to in a moment, and then down the street from the Spirit on Billings Road, which we'll take a look at in a moment to see if there's any updates. But I heard that Michaels has got some out somewhere over the fall on Halloween. I know Guitars is going recently to the video, I'll possibly be in the Hills location with one of my good friends on YouTube. So we're gonna go see if this Michaels has anything to, to, to look at. So let's go inside. So we do have a little bit here, like we have these like stick things that we've seen before, like the ghosts and the, egg, the candy corn, the little stitch gingerbread guy, some roses and some other stuff. There's a skeleton spider, and then they got a little bit of the spooky towns here on display. Then some more stuff over here, like they got the bones, lots of stuff. There's more fall stuff in the back, which you look at now. Like there's some stuff right there over here. They got some forfeit dry and some stuff on clearance, so yeah. There's some uh, stuff here. We're we'll probably gonna see this on this place soon. 
By the way, we're still somewhere in the fourth drive. We still got uh, another fight. We're still, uh, we're gonna be filming at Elk Grove. I was still planning to write on more of our fireworks with Reese and Sarah over when I would have been better in like the next couple weeks. There's some flowers, so they got the weaves here. Some pillows, some home decor signage, uh, some woodland creatures, fake pumpkins with the letters on them. A pillow, some footballs with letters on them. More pillows, and there's some signs. We got the rugs. We got all these weaves, fake weaves. I see some more stuff over here actually. A little bit of pumpkins over here. Here's some fall floor, like the orange colored stuff. Then you got the fake, these pumpkin things here. And uh, some more of these orange colored flowers. And that might be it for this Michael Lewis. You do have a little bit here, but don't get any of the big home decor yet. But okay, we're gonna go to at home now. We'll see you there. Alright everyone, we made it to at home and last time we were here, this is the same location we went to last time and last time we were here, they did not have anything inside us of Halloween stuff, but that, that, that was, it's a little bit, it's like a week later, so a week or two later now, so we can just go in and take a look now. I don't see any Halloween here yet. You know when there's no Halloween? Maybe at the end of July. I already saw a bunch of videos off at home. I don't feel like going to the Geneva store after all time pottery, so. They do have empty shelves here. And you see, this stuff is all clearance. This is clearance stuff here. Yeah, not yet. Okay. Okay, let's see if we have now made it to Home Girls and Bloomingdale, and uh, it's connected to TJ Maxx. They moved over by where in the Bloomingdale Court where Spirit is, but now over here, and they have the came out space. I saw my. My dad's work, co-worker Judy actually saw some Halloween stuff at Home Goods over in Oakland, but we're going to this one, so let's go take a look. Uh, here's the Halloween stuff. You see, um, uh, they got a lot of stuff. They got the, a big troll with a big hat. They did some writing up stuff we're about to see here, like uh, somewhere. Probably saw some of that white stuff. I'm not sure though. Uh, we saw some of that at Hobby Lobby earlier. Gnomes. gnomes, lots of gnomes. Look at all these gnomes. They got the fake books so you can store stuff in. Like there's other books in here too. Like they get smaller like that. Look at this skeleton guy with the thing right there. There's a white stack of pumpkins and some Halloween weaves and some fall four. They got some shelves that they got for soon. The weaves. They got some food here. And right, we got Halloween pillows over on that side. We can look at. So, there's the skulls, the boo, and all the skull, more skulls, the bats, um, to the seating. Boo pillows. Pillows. Okay, we got one. I almost broke my leg when I was trying to walk past you, but I almost passed this stuff. They got the ballet dancing skeletons. The algebra board, or Ouija board, I don't know why they spell it like that. It's kind of weird. Um, look at these words. What are they, I can't even make out what these say. They blessed. So these look like more West, Blue, yeah. There's the raccoon and the fox. A skeleton. Or skull, I should say, and that. No, it's a dog pillow. Here's some fall pumpkins and leaves and the turkey. Thankful. Um, it's even nicer at this price. I guess they do have pretty good prices here, but that's... I guess it's a decent amount for a pillow, I should say. Some towels. Some blankets, or should I throw blankets? Um, the ghost, yeah, they got our, our witches hats and broomsticks and cauldrons and other stuff here. Look at this giant bowl, it's blue. Tyrant, that's where my grandparents are from. I just posted one of my mom's trips there recently on the channel, go check it out. Would you like to take one and measure twice? Okay, we're gonna head down to the spear next, which is a lot there, which I'll show in a moment, but. I did drive by the Sean Mugs Beer on Barrington Road. Nothing has changed ever since I went there last time in the vi last video you just saw, so no need to film there. But we're gonna head down to the other Spear and I'm booming this. Let's just go there. Ready? All right, guys, I'm here to give you an update on the Booming Nails Beer, how we show on the former Asian Square. You got a lot here. They got the sign up on the big building. There's one on the side and there's one over on the street, too. Let's see what we got inside. So, you see, we already got the big Spear. Well, they got the Halloween sign up there. Uh, they got, what is that sign that's on the side there? Halloween sign, all the signage over here. We're gonna take a peek inside to make sure there's no one in there. 
Don't see anyone in the right now, so that's good. Um, they got the wall set up in there. I thought they were still got the paint, but I think that's just like a... They were just getting the metal parts of it in there. But I actually, I did see the metal parts in there. It's kind of hard to see with the glare, but the light, the metal parts of the beam are in there. They got the walls up. It's hard to see. It's going to be hard to see in there because of the... They got the books there. They got some signs here. Look, they got some signs. They moved them inside. The baskets are there. And they got some water there too from Kirkland. This is a weird wall. I'm thirsty for water right now. It's so hot outside. That's how the best shot you can get to the inside. Let me see if I can zoom in. See my reflection. And now we're gonna look at the side of the building here. Oh, let's see if we can see over here. Not much. So, uh, we're gonna be looking over on the side here now. So, there it is. There's the Spirit Halloween sign. It looks like the sun is fading away, so that's not good. But over here we got this spirit sign. Very big spirit sign on the side building. And this is, you feel the texture, it's just like, that's the industrial building over there. Yeah, that's the updates we have here. It's real Halloween. We're gonna go to our last stop now, which is all time part of you. We'll see you there. Okay, here's the last of the day, all time part of it. Let's see if there's anything changed in here since the last time we were here. So we still have all the, the fall decor here with all these stuff, but they do have the weathered pumpkins over there and some fall stuff in the corner. Um, yeah, we already looked at that stuff over there, but what we're going to be focusing on is just, this is all the hallways that they have with all these weathered pumpkins that they have every year. And all these weathered pumpkins, and there's some other pumpkins over there. Almost shot the camera out of my hand. I think they might have changed the texture of these. I can't remember what they like these before. They're pretty light. S. Shit. Where's the H? Don't tweet or don't do that. Why? Because somebody set up for them. People are kind of doing what my mother saw. Bop. We don't want to start this. Oh, well, how about this? No. Boo. This is all we have for Halloween stuff. There's an H. Don't do that. We can check over on the other side. We should, yeah, we should go check over here. So it's still 50% off on the yard stuff over here. They got all the gnomes and the angels. You see these are out of my church. We got pillows here. There's that Halloween stuff you want here, but yeah. That's all we got for all time party right now. Just the pumpkins with the weathers on them and some gel clings and that's it. Water core. Alright, that's it for the shopping adventure. We're doing more, I think, and uh, we're just gonna do it just a little bit next week because I, I have a busy week next week. So I think next week we're gonna be checking out the North Spirit and the Downers Grove Spirit. And then we're gonna check for Highland Park since we have a giant bar over there. I'm not sure what to do yet, but we'll see about that. And uh, also, we're gonna be going to Cracker Barrel next week in Naperville. So, yep, that will be a good, that will be our first time at Cracker Barrel to see for how we so I know they got the how we already. So that's our plan for next week, and then the week after that we're probably going to go check out the McHenry Spirit and then do a few places like Goody, including a Cracker Bell over there, and a new Hobby Lobby, and maybe a Michael's or Home Goods, but we'll see about that. But yep, that's it for now, and I'll see you guys. Uh, and actually, I am working on some more, I try not to laugh videos, but they're just taking forever to process because they're very long. But the one I was currently working on before I left was like almost close to three hours, I was working 
I was just, I think it started, I started working out at 10 at night last night and then I think it was, before I left it was still working, but yeah, it will be up with it soon, I promise. And I have another more uploading, another shorter time not to have me to coming soon too, but yeah. But anyways, that's it for now and I'll see you guys later, bye. Well, hey there, GMA fans, Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here, so go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.